guys hear me okay? Yeah. Yes. Is this thing on? Sorry. <laughs> I don't hear my echoes. Uh, no, I just I go up to the plate and, and um, you know I realized they weren't bringing the lefty to face me, so I was getting an opportunity and and uh, you know I looked at this the situation. It was uh, you know a tie game with a runner on second base, and I thought this is house money right here. I can do no wrong. So <laughs> uh, you know I, 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 I right before I stepped into the box, I went back to an bat I had in 2010 in the NLDS against the Braves, and uh, in Game Three in Atlanta, I drew a walk in the ninth. And there was a time I stepped out of the box that at bat. And I thought the entire world would see me shaking in my baseball cap. <laughs> I mean, it was one of the more nervous at bats I've ever had in my life. And I stepped out of the box, come, you know, in, in game five here, and I remember thinking, I don't feel any of that. I, uh, I said, oh. I had a calmness to me that just, it, it felt like, uh, you know, I, I, it was just, I, it was, I can't even describe the feeling that I had, so, um, you know, I was just looking for for a pitch to do like what I was trying to do and, and uh, try to hit the ball hard and then hope that, uh, you know, I could find some grass out in the outfield and, and, and Joaquin could score and win the game. And, and uh, you know, I got to 2-0 and, you know, I've, I've heard numerous times of people saying, man, he's, you know, walking throwing six or eight balls, you should be looking to take a strike right here, he can't find the zone. And, it didn't even cross my mind. He'd thrown six straight balls. I completely forgot and, and flan over at third base. He's telling, you know, he's just he's zoning it up. He's telling me to look for it right there. So I knew exactly where I was going to look for it. And, uh, you know, and, and walk it through it right where I was looking. And, you know, just put a good swing on it. And, uh, you know, I, I seem to have hit a lot of those balls before. And then the outfielders didn't have to take a step to catch it. So initially I was just like praying, like, please just get over his head, get over his head. And, and, uh, and then when I realized it was, it was going to get over his head, that's when I threw my hand up in the air. And, and I can distinctively hear you fans getting louder and louder. That's right. And I'm thinking, I already know this is a game winner. Do you guys know this is going over the fence? Because it sort of sounds like it. And, and I remember seeing it sneak over over the fence and high five Roberto at first base, and then after that, it's a complete blur. I yeah, <laughs> I was going to ask you if you remember anything about that home run. Track. I had no 